Hey what's up guys, it's Psycho here and today I have a beastly glitch for you guys. It is in fact on the new map, Mob of the Dead. Uh, now, my last zombie glitch video has got about 3,000 views which is insane. So I thought I'd bring you guys some more zombie glitches. And today basically the person who deserves all of the credit is Josh Lee Wilkes. Uh, I'll leave his link in the description. Um, he deserves all the credit. He's found this glitch. I don't think he's even uploaded it on his own channel. Uh, this video will probably get uploaded onto his channel. So. Um, yeah, uh, he deserves all the credit. He found this uh, glitch. Don't think it's anywhere else on YouTube. So I'm just going to get into it, tell you guys how to do it. Uh, there is two points of perspective. The first one you're seeing is my screen, and the, like I'm showing you how to do it. And the next one is Josh's. Well, my screen, but Josh is showing you how to do it. You do need two people, so bear that in mind. Now, I what I had to do, I had to go in front of that door. Rewind if you didn't see it. It's that little doorway. You have to go and to get the warden's key sometimes and open the other door you see what I mean just rewind if you don't know what I mean but basically you have to hold a grenade uh, in front of it uh, and blow yourself up go into the afterlife mode leave the game uh, get your friend to invite you back and then join back and then you will have the door you will see the light in a minute you'll see what I mean basically you don't have to pay for the door you can just walk straight through it and the zombies will in fact like walk straight past you or just like block like well it's a barrier really so they just like pile up there you will see a bit of gameplay of me doing it in a minute um so it is a beast glitch you will get to a high round on it so just try it it was that door back there if you didn't see uh so yeah you will get to a high round uh the only downside to this glitch is that when once the person who has done the glitch because the person who's not in the glitch can't get through it but the person who did the glitch hold the grenade can go through it you'll see what i mean in a minute guys um it is beastly like look here you just walk straight through it it is this this glitch is probably one of the best glitches on the like map and it was all thanks to josh lee wilkes uh he helped me f like i'm recording it and he helped he just hit me up on skype and said do you want to do a glitch so i thought yeah why not um and this is in fact it so you will get to really high rounds on this uh like i was saying a minute ago uh, it is only for the person who held the grenade um you will be seeing what the other person's perspective is in a few minutes um but the down, like I said, the downside to this is once you're in this glitch, the person with the grenade cannot open any doors um, like that you have to pay for. It. You can also get drops. You just about to see. So yeah, the the person who's in the glitch won't be able to buy any doors, so you won't be able to open any doors. Basically, you can still buy guns off the wall. You can still throw grenades. You can still like get power ups and all that shit. But you just can't open doors, which is kind of unfortunate. If if you could, that'd be like amazing. So you're gonna have to let the other person like, because obviously they'd all be piling up to you. So you, the other person can just be shooting them, like pointing on off them, because they won't get killed. And it does work on all of the doors that have that little power thing on it as you see look this door would normally have a thing on it it's not there i can just walk straight through it and yet again they pile up there uh, uh josh as you can see can't get in it uh, you will be seeing my perspective in a minute what josh is seeing now so like i said they can't get in it they will just run either run straight past you so you have to go out a little bit dip them back in and then they'll just sit there um it is pretty cool so like every one of them doors you can walk straight through and it does work on every door we've tried it so it is just an amazing glitch so if you need like cover or out if you do the glitch you can just jump back in then one of them places and just basically be invincible and just hope the other person don't get downed um because the zombies have no chance of getting you there's no way whatsoever they can get through it from their perspective it's just a door as it usually is but obviously you've done the glitch and they can't get you so yeah this is just getting into my perspective um i'll just quickly go through what you got to do because this is this is the like the hard of it so basically you want to start a custom game on your own revive yourself uh, as soon as you've done that pause the game uh, invite your friend I don't know who you'll be inviting but just invite whoever you're playing with straight away uh, what you'll need to do after that is finish the ground off and let the person spawn in then they need to go and do what I did in the first bit which is hold a grenade in front of the door uh, and then they'll be able to get in it so like this is basically two perspectives so you guys get a good idea of what to do because I know like other people might just do it from one perspective but I want to show you guys what to do on both like terms so look as you can see it's just joined so I just quickly tried to end the round as fast as I could um, so yeah I'll just fast forward until I end the, end the round so I'll see you guys in a minute
So now I'm back, the next thing you need to do is open the door, which you're about to see, it costs a thousand points, so you obviously need to rack up a thousand points before you do this, which should be added in the first round, it's fairly easy. Now the other person needs to run down here to where you are, you need to wait for him, you do need to be close by, so I would recommend standing like right next to him, you're just waiting for Josh to come down, jump down and do it. Um, as you can see, he's just about to hold the grenade now, and as soon as he hits a grenade, I'm just going to explain it again, as soon as he blows up, goes into half-life mode, needs to back out, I invite him, and then he joins back, then he can walk through any of them doors. Now, I have a clip at the end where you could, well, well, we didn't even realise, we were recording this, and we found another spot, like, the little spots where the warden keys are sometimes, you can, in fact, get up there without, like, downing yourself. It is really cool, guys. Like, um... So like you can see me here inviting him, he can get anywhere where there's one of them little mark things where you know where you where you would normally have to go into afterlife, he can do it without afterlife, so it is really cool glitch. So here guys you can see me end, trying to end the round as fast as I can. Um I'll just fast forward this bit and then join you back when Josh has joined, so I'll see you guys in a minute. So here guys, I'm back, I've just wiped out the zombies, as you can see we went into the third round. Now, this is magic, but oof, where is he gone? Like, li this is what the zombies see, and as you can see, he can just walk in and out freely, whenever he wants. Just ju jump back in there if he needs cover, needs a bit of time, just sit back in there, reload. Um, I cannot get in it, so it is kind of weird, but there isn't, I don't know, if you have four players, you might be able to get two people in there. We haven't tried that yet, but you guys will have to experiment. You may be able to get four players in there, just like showing this bit off, you can get in there, um, which is just insane, because this glitch, seriously, is good, guys. So, basically, we have got a secret little thing that we didn't think we'd do, so we'll just get into that now. Now, as I was saying earlier, you can in fact jump into the place where the warden's key would be as you can see you've got a strafe jump it look like, just straight in there now i'll fail the first time lol uh, but you will be able to see i will not be able to get in it so it's only josh that'll be able to get in it or the second player whoever's done the glitch look completely cannot get in it so this glitch is just insane so yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video please leave a like if you did comment down below on what you thought of this glitch also check out josh's channel he deserves all of the credit f for making this well finding this video uh if you're watching this on josh's channel please come and check out my channel uh, as i've commentated and made this video for josh so once again guys i hope you've enjoyed the video please come and check out my channel if you're watching this on josh's channel i'm almost hitting 250 subs which is insane so if you haven't already guys please subscribe to both of our channels like the video it'd be appreciated if you could share the video maybe on twitter facebook whatever it would all help we'd appreciate it the most so i thank you guys for watching this video hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you guys later